Okay, so today in the garden, I am going to use some Epsom salt and give the bucket garden a leaf bath, if you wish. So Epsom salt, magnesium sulfate, is awesome for plants and it gives them a boost. It can help in your seed starter, lots of things. Who knew something that I love to take a hot bath in after working out hard or you know, just to relax could also be something great for your garden. It will help your plants be able to absorb more of the minerals. It prevents leaf curl or helps with it. Lots of different things. Um, so a lot of people have said, well, what they do is put it in a watering can and, you know, sprinkle it on their plants. But because of, we have a hanging garden, I'm gonna use my old miracle Grow sprayer and I put about a cup to a cup and a half in the sprayer, and then I'm gonna attach it to the hose and give the plants a nice water down. Now you can also put this inside the plants um, in your buckets themselves and let it trickle down through, um, and that will work as well. But I'm gonna do a leaf spray, and I do this every couple of weeks, and I've noticed a big change. The leaves are greener, lots of different stuff. So uh, mix it up and getting ready. Okay, so we're gonna just sprinkle this onto the plant's leaves. It's a very windy day today, so these will dry off pretty quick. But you can see, we did this a couple of weeks ago for the first time and tried it. Look how green these leaves are this time. Even better than they were before. So we actually are putting this on all the different plants and for any of the buckets that are down low enough, I also put it into the bucket and then also sprinkle it on the leaves. And I'm just amazed at how green the leaves have gotten on all the different plants. And the tomatoes are starting to come in nice and red. Look at these, aren't they great in the clusters? How great is this? So every couple of weeks, we're gonna give this a shot. And one of the things that will be interesting to see is we've been having an issue with some of the moths getting into the plants and getting little, um, caterpillars if you would and they get on the backs of the leaves and eat holes in them and since the magnesium and sulfate or the epsom salt is actually a salt when it's sprayed on let's see if it helps with getting rid of some of the bugs as well so it'll be an interesting experiment as we've been having all through the year in the bucket garden and see how these turn out but i have noticed a distinct difference in the last couple of weeks after using this. Look at all how green they are. Sorry, this is just awesome. And it's just an inexpensive Epsom salt in a sprayer. Not the perfect ratios maybe, but it seems to be working really well for my plants, just coming right out of the spreader. And because I have so many, it would be hard to do it with just a little bucket, and especially with the raised ones that we have. Okay, so another trick to try in your bucket garden.